Well, hello everybody! Welcome back to the Entropy Center. Um, where we left off, we just left the outside area. The really nice looking outside area. Astra still doesn't have her hat. They stole our hat. Oh, yeah, um, thing. That's pretty. Ah, this is my favorite. Shh. I love how she just keeps talking. I'm trying to read it, kind of. <laughs> that one was red. Uh, let's see, we got Lore. Oh, Lori Danells. Entropy bot request. Devin, hey yo. Can I get. Yes, can I set up a decommission for Entropy bot 2231? Thanks. Reason? It looks at me funny. Lori, I'm sorry, but we have to decline this request. We simply can't decommission a specific entropy bot because they looked at you funny. Devin, Lori, I'm telling you. Now, listen here. That bot has been giving me hella side-eye. Like, proper side-eye. That boy knows exactly what it was doing. It's taunting me, Lori. I get up from my morning breakfast. I sit there with my entropy break. With my entropy break. Sip in my coffee, and it's just standing there, giving me the side eyes, smiling, judging me. They're sentient, I'm telling you. I don't know how or when, but they think. You can see it in their eyes, Lori. To Devon. I appreciate your concern, but entropy bots exhibit no emotion and are not sentient. They are incredibly helpful in all operations of the entropy center. Their smiles are merely a facade of fake emotion to appease staff members and provide a friendly face. I don't think it's giving you the side eye. Nope, they're sentient. They definitely are. They've evolved and developed sentience. Ooh, volleyball. A very concrete volleyball. Yeah. Okay. Can I follow them? No. Okay. Off we go! Oh wait, I forgot to set my timer again. That's my bad. Just a second. Because I'm going to try and cut these back down to 30 minutes. Because the last chapter took way too long. And I don't feel like doing that again. Puzzle 08... Zero one. New puzzle element introduced. Laser cube. Laser cube can enable laser inputs. Safety notice. Please do not stand in front of laser for extended periods of time, as it may cause a tickling sensation. That doesn't sound too bad. Caused by yourself disintegrating at an exponential rate. Oh. Nah, I seem fine. So we learned about this, um, in the last episode. I see. So those are the registers for them. Okay. Ooh. Secrets? No. Sad. Okay. Rewind you. Cool. Open? Nope. Da 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 da. Ha. In the end. Sparks. Ugh, that laser cube. Why does this person have... Why do these people have a laser cube in their office? HR team, 100% sustainable. Dear staff members, we are pleased to announce that the Entropy Center is now 100% sustainable. As of last Friday, we want to thank Mark Jacobs and his excellent effort in producing... 
a renewable electricity system for the center, and Sarah Hardy for being so pivotal in the growth of our food and horticulture garden. HR team, Christmas meal. Oh, that sounds nice. HR team, dear staff members, please note that this week's meal on Sunday is a Christmas dinner meal to coincide with Christmas Day on Earth. Merry Christmas, everyone. Sarah, it was Christmas meal last week. Aston, yeah, petition to have our own yearly calendar for annual events and not tied to Earth, way too confusing. Sam, if we rewind Earth one day, every day on the 26th of December, what does that... Does that mean we get Christmas dinner every day? This makes no sense. Yeah, I mean, I guess so. That would be kind of confusing. Anyway, give me you. Huh. I didn't think that worked. Oh. Haven't seen one of these in a while. Let's see how much the, the entropy energy is charged. 36. Making progress. Entering puzzle 0802. There is one bridge cube and one laser cube and one door and one button and one laser input. Astra? And, yes. Very helpful, but please stop. Object detection decreased to 150%. Haha! <laughs> I knew it! I knew that she was gonna be asked to stop after she increased it. That's wonderful. That's amazing game writing. Get back up here. Because uh, this needs to go in here. And then this needs to go here. Okay. If I start rewinding that, that falls. Um, now yeah, then I can just rewind that. Cool. It's nice that that functions while it's moving. Let's see. Puzzle areas 08 continued. Foliage conservation. Seed bank and sweet 102. I'll go sweet 102. I'm not allowed in Suite 102. Okay. Continue. Entropy Center. If no one comes from the future to stop you doing it, how bad can it be? Uh. Um. None of you follow that, okay? Use some common sense. Entropy Weekly. Entropy Technology. What does... What does this mean for Earth? I can't read the rest of that. Are you having an angry day or a happy day? Yeah. Okay. Got what it takes. Puzzle Operative Rolls. Now available. Free coffee. Free access to Entropy Museum. Good for the brain. Get an assigned puzzle exercise assistant. Foliage conservation. Directive. Enable those switches to remove lockdown. The earth is so much worse. Oh, it needs lasers. Don't you shoot me.
Wait, but I can't hit both at the same time. Oh, there's one right there. Ow! Ow! No! That didn't help! Give me this. Let me up. Ow! They're so angry. Ugh. And to think I thought those things were kind of cute and cuddly. They are cute, but they're not cuddly. Facility systems are in overdrive and falsely detecting you as a threat. I wouldn't take it personally. I'm taking it very personally, actually. Ugh. The Earth looks so much worse. Everyone is dead. I mean, everyone died a long time ago when it first started exploding, but. Locker. Cere Someone just has cereal in their locker? Okay. New deal. Oh, no secrets. Secrets? Oh, no, not secrets. Secrets? Nope. Earlier there was a red one. What's with the fresh paint job? Exceptional circumstances of severe civil unrest or security requirements. They've only been deployed once when the Entropy Debate Club became rather disorderly. Hmm. Interesting. So they're the mean so they're meaner, is what I'm hearing. What's with all the fans? I'm sure I'll figure it out in a second. Area L5 group, noise. Carol, can anyone else hear that weird humming sound? James, yeah, what is it? Is any... Ditto. Champion. Guys, might be me. It's just so hot in here. Anyone else, like, really stuffy? <laughs> Calling all budding debaters. This week we are going to be debating the following topics. Pineapple on pizza, yes or no? Entropy puzzles, too hard or too easy? Rewind Earth? Shall we rewind Earth if they are the source of their own destruction? Test your de debating skills, improve your argumentative literacy, argue and yell at your peers, civilly, curse and swear at people's opinions without getting reported to HR. You still could. Don't go too hard. See you there, Thursday Research Lab. Oh wait. So those are the debates that cause the stun bots to need to come out. Oh wait, oh three. Look at all the little plants. Oh. Okay, platform. Probably for you.
I now see the issue. Hmm. Can I not throw this? It won't let me throw it. I forgot the button to throw things, anyway. Because I knew I was able to throw things. I forgot how to do it. Anyway, how do I... Oh, wait! I got it. I got it, I got it, I got it, I got it, I got it. I'm decently smart after all. Eh, I have some intelligence at least. Okay, all the way. I don't know why that was so hard. Oh, we're back outside again. That's nice. Jump pad. Cube. I'm guessing that's where I need to go. Secrets. Oh, yay, the pretty water's back. And the earth is still oh, falling apart. Looks like everyone here knew the world was ending. And had one last party together. I'd have kept on trying to fix it, you know? Wouldn't you? That's what makes you a great puzzle operative, Arya. You don't give up. <laughs> Thanks. Can I grab the hat? No. Astra needs her hat back. That's a very broken calculator. Ah! Okay. What are all these? I don't know what kind of documents those are. We got drinks. This is what she's talking about with party. Not bad. Gonna keep looking around for secrets though. Because they hide them everywhere. I mean, I found a computer in a cave, so. You gotta look. see anything. Okay. So, I definitely need this here. But then, I also probably need to use this with this. Okay, so that does work. I want this to be base though. Oh wait, no, this needs to be base because this is where it needs to return to. Okay. And then, bouncy. Yeah. 
Bitte. Okay. We're going to do it here. Cool. Yeah, I left that bouncing for a little too long. Stable. More secrets! Health and safety, repetitive rewinding, side effects. Dear Puzzle Operatives, we would like to remind you of the following side effects of repetitive rewinding. As you are all aware, you endure a personal self-isolated rewind event once you've completed all puzzles at the center, so that you can complete them for the first time again. To generate more entropy energy. We recommend that no puzzle operative receives a personal rewind event no more than twice a month. Excessive and repetitive personal rewind events can cause amnesia. Other minor side effects may include vomiting, nausea, headaches, achy joints, tinnitus, hair loss, balding, stuffy nose, piles, hemorrhoids, loss of limbs, loss of no loss of limb, loss of limbs. Hearing loss, sight loss, and dry skin. Sheesh. Maybe remind you that the main large entropy device that rewinds Earth is perfectly safe and no side effects have been observed. Kind regards, Entropy Center Health and Safety Team. So it's only when it's concentrated on like a person? This is locked. Give me this. Uh, man, I can't. Oh, wait. I can't launch you if... See, because I was like, yeah, I'll launch you, but I can't launch you if it won't turn on. Oh, wait. Let me just do this. And then... I need to rewind you up to a little further. There we go. So I can walk through here. Yeah, but then how do I... Oh, you... Yeah, okay, I forgot about that. Okay. Let me up. Let me up. Man, you're slow. Give me the cube. Ah, it's a laser cube. Where do I need to shoot this? I just need to do the same thing again. Okay. 
coin. We're gonna try this. Nope, I messed it up. No, that didn't work. This will work. I'm not sure. Okay, you go there. Hey, it did work. I didn't think that. Was how to solve that. Elevators? There's only one that's open. Ah, oh, chapter 8. Interesting. That was a short chapter. Again. Warning. Several entropy bots approaching your position. Recommendation. Run. They have taser sticks? Whatever they're called, like the lightning sticks. Shoot me. Nope, not that way. Oh, not this again. They're gonna infinitely come. Why? Why are there so many? I know at the start of it, like at the start of this, it told you how many there were. Ow!
Okay, up here. Got that. They're just gonna keep coming. Ow. How do you still see me? Don't break that. Ugh! Lockdown, lockdowns. Lockdown. Those are annoying. That's not very good. Giant cube. Uh. Oh, I died. <laughs> I stopped rewinding because I saw the door and I was like, you know what? I want to see what's behind the door. And then I just crushed myself. Yeah, see? Sandball. Patterns. Hey, Lane. I just wanted to get in touch regarding the latest Entropy Rewind events of Earth. I know you're analyzing this subject as well with the Humanitarian Study Team. Well, the latest data is, well, I'll let it speak for itself. Are you seeing this pattern too? We're seeing a 60% drop in random natural disaster events and a 76% rise in cataclysmic events caused by humanity. We used to be about saving endangered species and wildlife. Now we seem to mostly be caught up in humanity-based affairs. How much longer before this gets out of hand? I'm going to be hosting a lecture during this Friday's meeting, going into more detail about this. Let's catch up soon, Sam. HR team, Friday meeting to all Entropy Center staff. Please note that this Friday's staff meeting is ma now mandatory. Dr. Sam Ball is hosting a lecture regarding some important findings regarding the frequency of the type of pataclysmic events that we are encountering. Kind regards, Entropy Center HR team. So I think that's where I need to go. Also, my timer just went up, so we'll finish up really quick. But what's up here? Oh, kidding, I have to break it to... There we go. Ha! Secrets! We'll just finish up looking around this area and then we'll all end the video here. Entropy Cat Facts. Cat Facts. <laughs> oh boy. Entropy Cat Facts. Hi Ben. Welcome to your daily dose of Entropy Cat Facts. <laughs> Did you know that cats have whiskers on the back of their front legs as well? And also that cats have 230 bones, whereas humans have 206. Amazing. Stay tuned for more Entropy Cat Facts. Meow. <laughs> ben, unsubscribe, please. Entropy Cat Facts. Thanks for subscribing to Entropy Cat Facts. As you are already a subscribed member, we will continue sending you cat facts. No, unsubscribe. No emails. Entropy Cat Facts. Thanks for subscribing to Entropy Cat Facts. As you are already a subscribed member, we will continue sending you cat facts. <laughs> uh, that's like every email sign up thing ever. You sign up for it once and you could never leave. Okay, well that's this entire area. 
Nice that I can jump from that height. Oh yeah, I'll just let that collapse. Um, anyway. I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Uh, this game's a lot of fun, and the earth is looking awful, by the way. Uh, I don't know what's gonna happen after this. But, we'll find out in the next episode. <laughs> Bye, everybody.